So, there's a laws of attraction, yes. And there's not only a laws of attraction, there's ways that we do these things. There's levels to these things. What am I talking about? The thirst is real. Not only is the thirst is real, but also this is calm relief. Stand up and also live laws about what's going on with me. So, sit back, relax. Let me get into this vibe for a few seconds. And come on, let's laugh. So, regardless of what you're doing, whether you're in your morning, about to go to work, at lunch, on your break, let's let some laughters happen. Come on, because if you laugh, that means you're going to have some, a great day. So, you ready? <laughs> let's go. Hey, it's me. I'm JC. My JC. Good morning to you. Good afternoon to you. Every time you watch this, this is a daily blog. Also, this is maybe just kind of relief because I was going to give you a hair video, but my hair looks good and I'm not going to do nothing to my hair until probably next week. <laughs> so, I'm going to give you a common relief slash little stand up bit. Let me go. I'm really shocked by saying this. Spring fever is occurring. And it happened a little early. Like, people are like, what do you mean? So what if it's happened? I know the first day of spring just occurred, but not for the Thursday. And I understand warming up the weather. A lot of us get that little stem in the back end of us, and it's kind of like, cool. I am mine. I will talk to you. Great. For me, that does not work. Now, laws of attraction means this. I like you like me. We work out. Opposite attracts too. I hate you. I hate you too. Oh, we kiss. We made loud. We're in love. All that happens. Yes, I just literally just ran through several romantic comedies. I wonder if I could do romantic comedy. Oh, can you see it now? There's this guy with curly hair that loves burgundy. One day, he's 28, turning 29. He doesn't know what to do. He feels like he can never find love. Until he met this one guy on a walk because he was losing weight. And this one guy looked at him and said, I understand you. And he was a little broken hearted and guarded this whole time. And now they put on this next walk. After that, he got on lunch. Pretty soon, within two weeks, they realized they really like each other. And then I got on to a spam movie though. Like, I'm giving a pilot now. From two months to two weeks, they'll be in a relationship. To two months, they're moving in together. To four months, to, we'll do what? Okay, two years, they're getting married now. Wow, all this happened because he started this healthy path. And now look at him. What a ring. Yeah, that's what romantic comedies kind of sell, though, just in case. But if it does happen, hey, <laughs> we can walk in a day. It's weird to say this when it comes to traction. I get comments. I'm not going to lie. I actually have never really cared because I low-key probably am thirsty too. I say this because now my mouth is dry because I had to say I was thirsty. Oh my hands, you hate that. Back to the key of this. Laws of attraction is funny. Now, for me personally, it's weird to say this. Naturally, you probably like, ooh, he probably likes just a nice, simple guy. I actually really like aggressive dudes. You know, it's like you're kind of aggressive. There's a certain difference of aggressive, like, I'm going to beat you. And aggressive, like, come here. Mm. You know, that that just turns me on. I'm getting the, I'm getting the vapors. Mm, the vapors. Like, you know. Getting back to the story. <laughs> I kind of don't understand when people say stuff like, I can keep you warm. Okay. I got my own bed. What you mean? I got a, I got a warmer. What you mean? Like, what do you mean? I have a blanket. Keep me warm for what? It's about to be hot. Uh-uh. All that body heat. Too much. Just too much. Fight back above me, basically. Come up lines are very funny. <laughs> Cause it's never really ever smooth. Like I always thought, like a come on line be like a like a weird way to like do an intro. Like I saw you across the room. I just had to come and speak to you and say, "Wow, 
and they like leave. And they come back like a minute, minute or two later and be like, was that corny? I want them to say that instead of saying like, you into me too? Lucky I like that one. I don't know. That, my creepy ass. I'd be into that. Like, just, he, did, he did that. <laughs> so, weirdly, when it comes to attraction, for me as a person, naturally, I'm attracted to several different guys. I have told people all the time I'm just open. There's a big limit to what I am open to. And because uh, I'm Southern, yes, this is also because I'm Southern. I really don't tell people the truth a lot because I don't like hurting people's feelings. I really don't have time to be babysitting adults and I really ain't got time to be trying to have a few and then getting blocked because I told someone I'm not interested or if I'm, since I'm not taking that I have mind about me being with somebody and you're not seeing any pictures or you're not seeing me talk about it. You know, that's me. That's just me. But the thirst what the thirst ways, and I guess I'm a thirst trap too. I never knew. I used to be like, I could be a thirst trap. Not like not me. Mm-mm. Apparently me too. Low king, enter me, like with the confidence. Like, yes, 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 yes. But the one that I have innocence too, and my innocence is like, ew, oh. Change it up. Cause I wanna be husband. I'm I'm all, I always feel like I'd rather be husband material. Than just someone that you're going to come and just slide in and slide out and go. Or me slide in and slide out and go. Like, that's what I get from, yes, <laughs> Papianas. So I just, I just had to say it. Um, reason why I say this, because guess what? It's nothing wrong with being attracted to somebody and saying, hey, you know what? You look good today. Or, hey, you killing them. There's nothing wrong with that. But to say something like, God, look at those. Talking about, you know, my homies. My, my twins. My men, my boys. You know? Talking about the boys. I would love to just... I'm like, oh, whoa. What's with the motion? No. Calm that down. Then another comment. Then another comment. On the same picture. So it's like, you're not even original. First person did it. Creeped out. Another person did it. Very creeped out. The other person did it. I am now freaked out. I'm like in a corner with covers on saying, please make it go away. And in a weird way, you're trying your best to say, I didn't mean it. I was just joking. You put this in my comment for the world to see. When someone else pulls up their picture, likes, looks at it, questions it. Like I'm questioning you as a moment right now. I get worried out. Now don't get twisted. I'm not the most like person with like a hundred, two hundred million likes. That's not me. And one day, sure, it'll occur. When it occurs, grateful. And the thirstness probably will keep going. And when I get used to it, probably not. I'm too wholesome. I can't be doing all that. Uh, I won't be sacred for mine. Well, when I get them. If I ever get them. I'm not being so wholesome, man. Anyways, what I'm always going to say to you is this. When you say crazy things like this, be mindful of both parties. Because, like, end of the day, I'm not saying this to be like, oh, get woke. Yeah. No, nah, because, honestly, I probably have done this, too. There's one guy I've probably done this to straight up because I look at him, I always like his picture. And this happens, my, when I say this, I do this to buy like, 85 dudes. And there's like top four. Any picture, like heart, like heart, 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 heart. Even time they like down, I be like, nah, you the baddest. That is, I always say that. <laughs> but the reason why I say that is because I want you to always realize that, hey, I'm looking at you. I don't care what no one else in the world looks at. I'm looking at you. And for attraction, I have enough confidence in me never to understand. Like compliments work, but it's the difference of a compliment. I say, hey, you look nice. Hey, your eyes. Oh, my gosh, your eyes. Even with the, like, beard. Mm, your beard. Ooh, your hair. There's a way of saying things where it doesn't start come off as, you know, stranger danger. Yeah, like, stranger danger is occurring in my mind. And I'm like, ooh, parent, parent, parent. Dory, Dory, Dory. Now I'm on. Yes, this man is being too thirsty. I'm just saying. <laughs> Because what I want you to realize is this. When you say something that left, 
There ain't no way I'm being right. And then you're like, ooh, why isn't he talking to me? How come he doesn't video chat with me? Why can't we not do this for real? Why does he not give me a shot? Hmm, what is going on with me is I am running away. Like, hey, hey, I want you so bad. And I'm like, ooh, he's crazy. Not good crazy. Me. No, psycho crazy. No, no, don't stop. Dope. You know? And there's nothing wrong with it. Like, I'm cool with crazy guys. I'm crazy. I can say it and be okay with it. You know? But honestly, in laws of attraction, if I'm like, hey, hey, and we have a nice nice mutual thing, go along with that. Send me a picture. Oh my god, look at you. Oh my god. And we have a video chat, we compliment each other equally. Equally. If you give too much compliments and other ones I say nothing back, it's not that the other ones are not attractive. It's just sometimes you lay in a little thick. Thick. Real thick. Like, you have like a lift tongue numb because it's that thick. That's what I'm saying to you, basically. Now, all I know, if you laugh at any of this, thumb me up. If you understand me at all, heart this. In the comments, talk about your experience when they got when someone was making you the thirst trap of the day. And yes, this is to all my guys out there. Do not get offensive. They're just jokes. Because <laughs> at the end of the day, I understand. Hey, we're all human and we all make mistakes. And we all do something that's a little extreme. I'm extreme about a lot of stuff. Apparently, I was extreme about food. I was extreme about soda. But I'm getting on the back path. I'm getting on the right path, y'all. Right path. So all in all, try your best to stay woke, try your best to get woke, and try your best to like more of my videos. And see you tomorrow <laughs> with the next one. Bye.